What is this planet next to the moon that we're seeing lately? Everybody's asking this, especially if we have clear skies. We look at the moon. Later tonight, you'll see a very bright source of light near to it. It's basically hanging under it. But what is the planet next to our moon? The beautiful crescent moon creeping over the northeastern horizon. It does, uh, it looks immediately a thin sliver, right? As you'll see, a very bright source of light. And although at first glance, this might look like a star, it's actually not a star, it's a planet. Stargazers have already caught a glimpse of this duo and they ask questions about which planet it is. One Twitter user said, there's an impressive looking crescent moon next to a bright star or planet this morning. Thought I'd give you my new astronomy app to test a, a run to find out what it is. It showed me loads of objects thousands of light years away, but not the moon, probably only an alien UFO anyway. But anyway, so what is the planet next to the moon tonight? After the sun and the moon, Venus is the third brightest body in our skies. U.S. meteorologist Brandon Spinner tweeted, Excuse the blurry photo, but take a look at the moon this morning. The bright star to the right of the moon is actually Venus. It'll be visible again tomorrow, but we'll have cloud coverage, so enjoy it as much as you can if you have clear skies. Another person said, if you're up and about and have a clear sky, look at the northeast and you'll see a beautiful crescent moon low in the sky with a bright star beneath it. That star is actually the planet Venus, and you'll be hearing quite a lot about it, so take a good look. Another U.S.-based stargazer said, if you look out east at the moon rising, that bright star below it rising over the horizon now is Venus. If you could coax my body to cooperate to try to take pictures, I can see the whole thing through my bedroom window, he says. Now, what, why is Venus so bright at night? The second planet from the sun. It's coated in dense and cloudy atmosphere that makes it incredibly reflective. That's why. According to the California Institute of Technology, Caltech, the planet reflects up to 70% of the light that falls on it. That's why it's so bright. 70% of the light is reflected back out. The university said in its cool cosmos series, Venus is one of the brightest objects in the night sky. Venus is so bright because its thick clouds reflect most of the sunlight that reaches it, about 70% back into space, and because it is the closest planet to our Earth. Venus can often be seen within a few hours after sunset or before sunrise as the brightest object in the sky other than the moon. It looks like a very bright star. Venus is the brightest planet in the solar system, and the planet has been in the news this week for more critical reason. Astronomers have detected a rare gas in the planet's atmosphere that may have been created by alien microbes, they say. This is on Express UK by Sebastian Ketley. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Capota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.